Be Shalom, Kahalal Yahal Bashim Yahushai, Bahashim Makakadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles at Great Millstone. Want to get into this report as the reporters of prophecy, all right? And in this case, death and destruction, war, World War Three. all right? As reporters of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, we come to bring the current events, man. And indeed, we see prophecy that is um, going down in the form of these nations mobilizing for war. All right, that's all you hear about. This latest article from today is going in on how America is fucking fighting war war in two fronts, man. All right. And this motherfucker is going to eventually uh, provoke World War Three. It's going to go down, man. According to scriptures, according to prophecy. All right. China threatens military action. Beijing won't hesitate to use force to bring Taiwan back under its control. Chinese ambassador of Fran- to France warns. Okay. All right, let me get this real quick. This is in uh, second address nine. Second address nine. In the KJV. It says, he answered me then and said, measure then thou the time diligently in itself. And when thou seest part of the signs past, which I've told thee before. Okay, so... We're to measure the times, and we measure the times based on what the scriptures told us what was going to happen according to the biblical prophetic timeline, all right? Different things, the death, destruction, the pestilence, things that have to go down, and these are things that go down before the, uh, um, the, 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 the prophecy that if anybody in the know in these scriptures said, that says... That, the, that this place is reserved under fire. How is that going to happen? All right, but even before that, there's a lot of shit that's going to go down. Evil, a lot of bad times, okay? See? There's going to be pestilences. There's going to be plague, all right? There's going to be natural disasters. There's going to be World War Three Armageddon, all right? Nation invading one another. Come on. <laughs> so anybody in the know of this book, they know that these things have to befall uh, this place for destruction, sake for the most high, according to prophecy, man. All right, this is how he had planned it for for this place to fucking go down. All right, it says um, so. We're measuring that to- the time, the current event based on the biblical prophetic timeline, right? It says, and when we're, and we're measuring it diligently, okay? And, and when we're seeing the, these, this shit go down, we know that it's what he told us before, all right? It says, uh, thou, then thou shalt thou understand that it is the very same time when the highest will begin to visit the world which he made, okay? Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and upwards of the people in the, of the, in the world, then shalt thou well understand that the most high spake of these things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning, okay? And this is indeed considered an uproar of the people, all right? It's going to escalate into fucking uh, uh, actual action, all right? Combat. All right, it says, For like it, as all that is made in the world hath a beginning and an end, and the end is manifest. And that's how we know, based on these signs, that we're measuring the times to see. Okay. It says, uh, Beijing will use all possible means to regain control over Taiwan, including military ones. Chinese Ambassador Fran Luce has said, 
We can't leave Taiwan dependent, Lou insisted during his interview on Thursday with the YouTube channel Leave Noir. We'll take Taiwan by any means, by all means, including military ones. If we can't reunify the country by peaceful means, what else are we left to do, he pointed out. Becoming yet another Chinese official will offer such a warning. The ambassadors blamed the U.S. for stirring tensions around both Taiwan and Ukraine where Russia's military operation is ongoing. It says the Americans want to start two wars in the world, one in Europe and the other in Asia, he said. Okay, and that's all we need to get. All right, it's going fucking down. It is according to prophecy. They can't fucking stop it, man. All right, this is Isaiah 13 and 4. The noise of a multitude in the mountains like of a great, as of a great people. A tumultuous noise of, of the kingdoms of nations gathered together. Yahweh Yahua of hosts mustereth the host of the battle. So... All these nations and uh, these different uh, allies and fucking, you know what I'm saying, fucking um, enemies, all these, these players, all these players on the world stage, they, they can't do anything the most high is not fucking causing them to do alright the most high is mustering their spirit he's mustering them up to the battle okay he's stirring up their spirits the most high sealed the instruction okay it's prophesied to gonna go it's gonna go down and by God it's gonna fucking go down man and we see it right before our eyes all right, death and fucking destruction. Play time's over in this place. All right, they're gonna squeeze out the last little folly that they can out of the, the you know the months to come, and it's gonna smack them in the fucking face, you know, because especially America, these American fucking peons, man, they they just don't see it coming. All right. Most High is going to destroy this fucking place in an instant. It's going to be like one day to the next. It's going to be just fucking collapse all over these goddamn societies, man. Absolutely, fucking loopy, man. The Most High, the Most High is in the process of of uh, working in these minds of these people, man. Uh, uh, the elites, all right. The peons ain't doing a shit. But he's working in the minds of these elites. And uh, the, the, these nations, as it reads right here, the king, the, the kings of the nations, fucking, you know what I'm saying? The uh, the people who are making fucking decisions, the, uh, who are making the ones who really make the plays in these countries and nations. You see, they're they're <laughs> they're mobilizing that. The, the Most High is working in their mind to just fucking to, to close the shop all right finishing off in Joel 3 and 9 proclaim me this among the Gentiles prepare war wake up the mighty men let all the men of war draw near let them come up okay because World War 3 is prophesied which the second world has passed and there's one that's left to come World War 3 okay we see it. We see. We see it going down. China and Russia, the big boys on the fucking block, are gonna come out of America, man. It's gonna be a traditional war to start out. Tanks, and fucking drones, which isn't traditional, but uh, um, you know, modern warfare as they call it. And then it's gonna escalate to thermonuclear uh, holocaust. Okay. As prophesied in these scriptures. The Most High told us to proclaim me this, to proclaim it to the whole fucking world, man. Alright? To tell them to prepare for war. 
in the middle of the Lord of Yahweh Hashem Al Shai. That's how you know as well. He has his prophets out. He had his prophets out, um, Abba Vivens and um, a high priest Arya and Apostle Tahar out there for 30 fucking years telling you people, man, which is a very short time, but you know that we're in the fucking end, man. It's a guarantee. All right, satisfaction guaranteed, man. This place is going to be destroyed. We see the, the, you just see it so clearly. The, the downfall of this place, how it's taking the, the downward trajectory. You see, um, uh, if you look at on a fucking graph, if you will, see how this fucking place is fallen. Okay? It's all according to the Most High's plan. He's, and, and according to this scripture, he's drawing up all these nations, man. All right, under the noses, unbeknownst, unbeknownst to you stupid fucking people, man. All right, to take you by storm, World War Three, death and destruction, man. All right. All praises, honor, glory to Yahweh Shimei Shai. Shalom.